back from my trip to Germany and I hope you guys liked the vlogs that I had over there and I didn't really film too much of the way back because um, there's like hectic a lot like we had like barely any time for anything on the way there so I wasn't able to film anything I was only able to film like the the our landing from in Lisbon, uh, like in like Spain so like that was the only thing I could show you guys from that because there's just like way too much hectic going on and there's not enough time for me to grab up the camera and you know like start talking to you guys or like showing you guys something so I'm sorry for that so like I don't really have that much of the last week so this is why I decided to sit down with you guys because I wanted to tell you guys anyways of like um kind of what I think are the main difference between USA and Germany and besides the things that you probably saw on the videos I'm probably still gonna say those because you know why not I guess like kind of biggest things is that um, it's like very clean and like super clean like there's like barely any trash on the streets and like you know people actually care about the environment not like you know being like super rude but like that's just what it is like people actually care about the environment a lot over there there's a lot of bike drivers there's a lot of like farms at least where i live there's a lot of farms definitely a lot more than there is here and there the farms here are like more like nicer to the animals and like you know more environmental i guess so like that's like one big thing that everything's like more caring about the environment it's super clean there's not that many homeless people, which is really good because I've like, of being there for six months and I went to the city a lot and I only saw like one homeless person. And in America, you would see like, in a matter of a week or something, you'd see like 10 homeless people, which is crazy. But Germany has like a lot of things that they can like help people with. Like if they're at a job or like they don't have a job anymore or like they can't have, they don't get any more income or anything. Like Germany helps them with that, which is really good. The people overall, like in Germany, they are more like grumpy, but, and they don't really like, they're not really too friendly how they are here, which I kind of like because sometimes in America, people are a little too nice. Like they're like nice but then they don't like, you know, go deeper with you. But if you in Germany have like a good relationship with somebody, you can go deeper with them. And it's like nice because then you can like, you know, be more than just friends. You can like actually have like real good relationship with them, which sucks in America because here you're just nice, but there's nothing behind it, you know, there's just niceness, which is kind of annoying sometimes because you can't really have a deeper relationship with them, but it's whatever. You know, I have my friends and I go deep with them if there is ever any need to. People are like super judgmental there, like super judgmental, which sucks because I have been trying to not be judgmental and like people that are judgmental have been like getting on my nerves like here in America, in America. But when I went over there, like sometimes my friends over here say, oh, you're kind of judgmental. And I'm like, I don't think so. But then I went over to Germany and I was like, I am so not judgmental. Like, I am the least judgmental person there Like it was so crazy Not saying that I don't like my friends or anything, but I just like Sometimes there was like somebody that wasn't skinny or anything like that and they were like Oh look at them like look how fat they are not literally fat, but you know, they were like pointing it out And I'm like, okay, like so what? Like let them live. The food is like so not health super healthy there but it's definitely healthier than american food like mcdonald's like <laughs> it was so crazy like one day i went with my friends to mcdonald's because we were in the city and we were like whatever we'll just eat mcdonald's the 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 nuggets like they actually tasted and like the texture of it was actually like real meat which here in America it's like creamy and it's like a paste but in Germany it's like actually meat like the actual texture texture <laughs> texture of meat 
which, you know, is nice. And like the candy, it's sweet. And the, the, um, the options of candies is like, like not as much, but like it's way less or way more, way less artificial. So like, it's more like natural because Germany has like a lot of like regulations about their food, which is, you know, nice because I ate a lot of chocolate and candy, but I didn't really gain that much weight as if I would eat here in America. Like if I would eat the same amount of candy made from America in America, I would be fat <laughs> or like I would gain a few pounds, but I barely gained anything over there. And the air is also definitely nicer because people actually care about the environment. You can drink the tap water and it actually tastes really good. Like there was one city, one city in all of Germany where you can't really drink the water, like the tap water. I'm like, I mean, you can, but you shouldn't. And that is where my grandparents live in Frankfurt because there's a lot of factories and like that's how Frankfurt got like to be a city because of all the factories and stuff and that's why you shouldn't drink that tap water but I drank it and I was like fine it tasted decent like it wasn't the best but it wasn't the worst like it was definitely better than California or any other tap water here something that I thought wasn't gonna be like I thought there was gonna be like way less diversity in Germany and like everybody's gonna be like white and skinny and tall but to my surprise it's not like that anymore because of all the um, refugees and stuff. There's a lot of more different races in Germany, which I like a lot because I don't like white people that much. So I liked how there was more diversity than I thought. So, you know, that's like one of my main things. And regarding to my language, at first in Germany, I wasn't like when we first came, came there, it was all like, whoa everybody's speaking German like it was crazy because normally the only people that speak German around me is my family like when we live here like for the first few weeks I had to be like um what was that word again oh what was that word again oh what was that I couldn't I couldn't think of any words so and I kept on having to ask my mom what is that word again but after like the first week like around after we were there like around like maybe two weeks one week i don't know around like a little bit after we were there like i was pretty in the language but i still had to like ask sometimes because i didn't still didn't know perfectly but i thought that was crazy because you know it's my mother language i still speak it at home but yeah i'm not the best at speaking it when i have to only speak that language and it was crazy because from like speaking like 10% of the language you speak is German to like 100% of that like of speaking that language is like crazy and then the only time I spoke English was with the with the vlogs or like when somebody was like oh how good do you speak English oh can you speak English then I spoke English but like it was like pretty much never so once I came back the first day here or the second day I went and watched a movie with my friends my friend and like already some of the first conversations i like almost said something in german like i was like oh wait no english english <laughs> and like sometimes i was like confused as to what i was gonna say because i was thinking in german well not thinking i was still thinking in english but like you know it's starting to be harder for me to speak in english which is crazy just because of six weeks i have to actually think about what i'm gonna say in english and like, you know, it's crazy because German, German was just so like a habit that English wasn't a habit anymore. So I'm going to give you guys like kind of like two options of what I'm going to post next. I mean, one of the things I'm probably going to do anyways, but the other thing you guys let me know if you want to do that. So the one thing that I was probably going to do anyways, but you guys can still let me know if you don't want to do that at all. Even though my room is not that but spectacular. I would still like to do a room tour here and then my friend's gonna come in a few days hopefully and we're gonna have a sleepover so you guys let me know if you want to see that vlog if not okay I'll not upload it or I'll upload it we'll see 
So if you guys want to give me any suggestions of what I should um, do, go ahead and leave them down in the comments. I'm open to anything. Thank you guys for subscribing. I know we, don't, we aren't a lot of subscribers right now, but it's whatever. I'm going I'm to keep doing what I want to do. I'm going to keep uploading videos and doing videos and stuff because it's fun. But thank you guys for subscribing and thanks to the people that be commenting. I see you. Don't forget to subscribe, like if you like the video and share if you like any of my videos. You can go ahead and look back at all my videos. You can go ahead and share them with your friends or your family, anything. If you feel like they are for them or they like those, you can go ahead and share. And yeah, see you guys in my next video. Bye.